The state budget is close to a done deal. Lawmakers agreed on a $21 billion spending plan. It funds some of the high-profile issues that bog down negotiations. Teacher raises, state employee raises, teaching assistance, just to name a few. And tonight we're hearing from educators who have been waiting years for a pay increase. Adam Owens is live right now in downtown Raleigh. And Adam, what is the reaction like? Jackie, as you mentioned, there's more money for teachers and teacher assistants. Their jobs are safe. That is what we're told is in this new budget agreement. But tonight, one of the largest teacher groups in the state tells me they're not happy, and they told us why. House and Senate leaders have finally agreed on a budget. The offer. Uh, at this time, the largest teacher pay increase in state history. For educators, it sounds like heaven, but... I think the devil's in the details. That's coming from the North Carolina Association of Educators Vice President Mark Jewell. We actually have, you know, some, some strong concerns over this right now. Republican lawmakers say their budget gives teachers in the state an average 7% pay raise. And Senate President Pro Tem Phil Berger says it does more than that. The budget will also preserve teacher assistant positions, protect classroom funding, and continue to give superintendents broad flexibility to tailor classroom spending to their district's needs. Jules says that's the sales pitch. The reality, he says, is while teachers get an average pay increase of 7 percent. Those at the top of the pay scale, and these are your veteran teachers, those are with the most experience, uh, will be getting a much smaller amount. And bus drivers, cafeteria workers, those who support schools will only get half the raise of some other state employees, he says. And Jewel questions how it will be paid for. Some budget lines use lottery money and funds that may not stick around. We do feel like there's going to be job losses in order to fund this. We know it's an election year. Uh, we know that everyone's looking at the poll numbers. Jewel believes the budget was born out of politics. Republican lawmakers say it is history making. House Speaker Tom Tillis says millions placed in savings and reserves will make sure they deliver. So that the promise that we're making in this budget can continue to be fulfilled. Jewel also has some concerns about a new teacher pay scale that comes with this new budget agreement. He has concern, some concerns there, but it is very important that we point out that we have had news conferences and we've had news releases on this budget proposal, but what we do not have yet is the details of this budget actually put on paper, and we are promised that is coming very soon. Back to you. Adam Owens, live in downtown Raleigh. Thank you, Adam.